Get ready for a whole new world of fun with these awesome Aladdin figures inspired by the live action remake. Oh, hello friends. Look at my treasures I have discovered. Jasmine, Aladdin, and the genie. All for one amazing price. If you want, I give you good offer. Anyway, just kidding. <laughs> Guys, welcome to my market of Aladdin toys, and today we're going to be looking at Jasmine, Aladdin, and the Genie. So let's jump in and get a closer look at these really awesome doll figures. Ooh, I like it muy macho. First up is Aladdin, in his whole new look for the live action movie. You can see here he's got a boo sitting on his shoulder. Now the clothing design is a bit different from the animated movie. He's wearing a shirt first of all, uh, but you can see he still has his red vest on. You can see his hair is pretty much the same and he's got this cool little hat. The figure stands 11 inches tall and you can see that its body is pretty much all plastic other than his fabric shirt. Um, so the legs are gonna be really hard and stiff. His arms don't really move too much so he doesn't have too much flexibility other than sticking his arms up and out and his legs pretty much in the sitting down position. But overall, this is a pretty great replica from the live action movie version. You can pull the sleeves up or down if you really want to. And if you're wondering if Aladdin has abs just like in the animated version, yes he does. The Aladdin figure comes with a boo and he can sit right on his shoulder. He's a tiny little rubber figure. He's not poseable, but he does a great job at sitting on Aladdin's shoulder. Plus you can make him dance around and have some fun. Alright Abu, no more dancing, sit down with Aladdin and get ready for Jasmine, who looks absolutely amazing in her beautiful purple dress, something we haven't seen in the animated version where she pretty much just wears her turquoise signature outfit that we've all come to know and love. Like Aladdin, Jasmine's arms go up or out and her legs just bend forward. Um, her hair looks really great here, it's got a nice little design, kind of like the animated version, uh, but of course taking their own liberties, making it their own. As you can see, Jasmine really looks like royalty. She is absolutely beautiful. Don't confuse Jasmine for being just a pretty princess. She wants to take control of her own life and have some fun. I really like her earrings and she has matching gold shoes that are completely removable. The all new Jasmine has never looked better. All right, for our final character, it's the genie. And you've never had a friend like him. The new genie features a full fabric outfit over top his plastic body, which kind of hinders his arm movements a little bit. It just gets a little tight, but you could still move his arms in and out to get some really great poses like he's about to grant you your first wish. I really love that Disney created a human version of the genie. He looks really magical. I love this blue color and the golden ornate elements all throughout his outfit really shine. Like the two previous figures, he stands at 11 inches tall and his legs again are plastic featuring a little bit of fabric on the body just to give it a little extra depth and life to it. His necklace is removable, um, of course you can sit him down here just like Aladdin and this character just looks really great. I really love the details in the face on this one. Here's a side profile shot which gives you a really good look at his hair. Now you can recreate memorable moments from the movie or make up new adventures with the genie, Aladdin and Jasmine. So that's our look at the three live action characters. We have Jasmine, Aladdin, and the Genie. These characters look really great next to each other. Um, they're all $14.99 each. You can grab them right now, add them to your collection, and I know there's a couple other designs out there, deluxe versions and that sort of thing, so make sure you collect them all. What adventures are you gonna create with these new Aladdin figures? Leave your comment down below and let us know who your favorite Aladdin character is. And make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of our upcoming Disney videos. If you're a faithful subscriber, thank you so much for watching. If you're new, we've got tons of videos you have to watch right here.